What are you talking about? Don't make me repeat myself. I'm saying I'm breaking up with you. By the way, I am dating Mio right now. Oops. Sorry, Kanade. You know how persuasive he can be sometimes. You're joking. Oh my god, is that the so-called pandemonium? Looks like it. I am Kuhei Shibata, an ordinary high school student who just happened to pass by. So you are pursuing Mio while still dating me? Don't be so tense. It's you who didn't even notice it. Wow, he has the audacity to show up with the girl he cheated with and demand a breakup from his girlfriend that he cheated on. We've only been dating for just a month. Why? You look beautiful, but you are just too stiff. I got bored when we were dating. You cheated just for that reason? In that regard, Mio is so lovely and attentive. She listens to whatever I say. That's not it. It's because you're so persuasive. That's all I want to say. Bye. Satoru, you want to go to karaoke later? Sounds good. To commemorate myself for escaping the curse of my ex-girlfriend. <laughs> Her name is Kanade Amamiya. She is a famous girl in the school to the point we often hear stories about her. And the boy who just broke up with her is Satoru Takada. He is quite terrible, especially in terms of his relationship with girls. I have never heard good things about him in that regard. We all know that these two were dating and thought they looked like a perfect match, but... Even a dog does not interfere with a couple's fight. Let's leave them alone. It was just too harsh. Ah, wait! She is trembling. She was being cheated on and broken up like that. You can't blame her for that. Amemiya, are you alright? Bastard! Eh? How dare he break up with me like that! He will pay for this! So she was not trembling because she was crying, but because she was angry. Uh, who are you? Um, I was worried, so I was trying to comfort you, but looks like you don't need it. Huh? A nerdy person like you was worried about me? You must be joking! I thought you were crying because of that harsh breakup. Why would I cry about something like that? I was pissed off because it was him who confessed to me a month ago, and now he dumped me! Oh. Then does that mean Satoru dumped a girl a month later after confessing? I feel like something is off, but... Right. You go out with me. What? You mean going to karaoke to relieve the stress? No, I'm saying to be my boyfriend. Huh? Then the next day. Kohei, do you want to go somewhere else after school? I just want to go home and play games. Hey, it's too early to have a date at home. What are you trying to do to me? We became a fake couple. Um, are you sure this will work? They are all looking at us. Of course. If I draw enough attention, then even Satoru will feel upset if he sees me flirting with a nerd like you. When he comes up and says, let's get back together, this time I will flat out say no. This person is mean too. Darling, I like you so much. Thanks. Mio, let's skip the class and go to the rooftop. We shouldn't do that. It's almost the midterm exams. We should properly attend the classes. It will be fine. I know you also want to spend some alone time with me. But still... What the... Whoa, she's being ignored by someone who was her boyfriend just until yesterday. Darling, I feel like kissing right now. Take out your tongue. Wait, calm down. Why starting from the deep kiss first? We are at school right now, you know? Don't want to rave from me! This is my first kiss, so be grateful and accept it! This is a bit too much. You are so annoying! You just need to give me your body. That's what a douchebag would say! <laughs> what are they doing? A skit, I guess. Yeah, they're so close. Then after school. Why didn't he get jealous at all? I don't think he would get jealous that easily since you guys already broke up. I mean, no matter how you see it, there is no way he would get jealous. This exceptionally beautiful girl is flirting with a guy, you know? People usually would notice it right. You just said it yourself. Maybe. It could be that you were too nerdy and that it didn't work. That's why Satoru didn't get jealous at all. It's a prejudice and it's somewhat insulting. 
Anyway, I'm not that nerdy, okay? Really? Then what is your favorite clothing brand? Eh, uh, Unicudo? Oh. Come here for a sec. Eh? Where are we going? Even though we're not a real couple, to the outside eyes, you are still my boyfriend. It will be embarrassing if you wear such a lame outfit. So I will choose it for you. What do you think? You'll feel much more confident if you wear something stylish, no? Well, I feel itchy wearing these clothes. You are from head to toe a nerd. Look at me, be confident. Come on, what do you think about my style? Now that you've seen me in my casual outfit, you can compliment however you want. I was planning to say you are cute. Well, not anymore. You're not like me, but the clothes still look good on you. It's fine, you don't have to compliment me. How can this outfit look good on a nerd? What are you saying? Have some confidence. I'm the one who put this together this outfit, so of course you look good. Th thanks Then, the next one is this. Hey, I'm Amiya. Um, what? I might be ignorant about fashion, but I am sure this outfit is lame. What are you talking about? It looks good on you. Even if you say I look good in this outfit, it still won't make me any happier. <laughs> That's so funny! Why did you even wear it? You should have known it was lame the minute you saw it! Oh my god, my stomach hurts! <laughs> Didn't know she would make this kind of face when she laughs. Uh, wait, we're not done yet? I want to go home and play my games. What are you saying? It's a date, so the next stop is already decided. Date? I will not give up until I turn you into the type of guy I like. In the end, the shopping continues until Amemiya's curfew. Then, about one week after me and Amemiya, I mean, Kanade started our fake couple relationship. Hey, Kohei, you look different these past few days. Eh? Where? Um, I mean, the way you wear your school uniform has made you look quite cool, and your hairstyle makes you look more handsome. Kanade has been pestering me about my appearance. I have not once thought that I would do my hair every day until now. So it's Kanade. I still cannot believe that you are dating that Ame Mia. I know, I sometimes still doubt that it's not a dream. Anyway, have you noticed that the number of girls looking at you has increased? Girls? Since you got yourself a makeover, the girls have been looking at you. Did you really not notice it? Yeah, I haven't noticed it at all. Ha! <laughs> Sad. The Kohei that was supposed to be a nerd just like me was gone. To be honest, I should feel good getting attention from girls. The old me would have been over the moon, but right now? Kohei! Do you have a minute? There is something I want to say to you. M mio Why? Is it about... We can't talk here? Yeah, we can't. It has to be between us. So, what is it that you want to talk about? I will get straight to the point. I want you to become my boyfriend. Are you being serious right now? Of course I'm being serious. I'll break up with Satoru, so you break up with Kanade and go out with me. Fukuyama, think something is wrong with you. Well, it's just that I can't stop thinking about you. It can't be helped. Do you have a grudge against Kanade or something? First is Satoru, and now you are targeting me. Is this one of your schemes? It has nothing to do with Kanade. Just, you know, the grass is always greener on the other side, so seeing someone else's boyfriend makes me want to steal them. You are the worst. I'm not doing something wrong here. I didn't lie when I said I couldn't stop thinking about you. How about you? Don't you think I'm a better option than that rude Kanade? I sometimes think that a person like Kanade might not be suitable for me. You see? That's why you should just date. That's why I chose her. Eh? I don't really care what you think of me. I am Kanade's boyfriend right now. I only have eyes for her. Ditching the game you are playing right now and reaching out to other games. Even in the gaming world, it is a disgrace. I will keep this whole conversation a secret from Satoru, so don't ever talk about this again. I'm going back to the classroom. You should go back too or you'll be late for class. Um, how devoted. Now you have intrigued me even more. A week after that incident. Good afternoon. Eh, that's strange. I heard from Sensei that Kanade fainted due to anemia. 
If you're looking for Kanade, she's not here. F Fukuyama? What are you doing here? What do you mean she is not here? <laughs> I asked Sensei to lure you here. For what? Of course, it's to make you mine. You're still talking about... What? How stubborn. It's fine, right? You have nothing to lose if you date me. If you mind, we can check our physical compatibility here right now before we start dating. Don't make me repeat myself. I have zero intention of breaking up with her. Then, what do you think she would think? Eh? Huh? Kohei? Hanade, why are you here? I heard from Sensei that you passed out and that you're in the nurse's office now. Oh my god, I got framed! Anyway, what is Mio doing here? It is not what you think it is. I was also called by her. Kanade! Kohei forced me! I told him that I have Satoru and can't date him! Then he suddenly... Eh? Huh? Enough. I know. How can you get duped that easily? That's why you're still a nerd. Eh? Huh? What? Wait, wait a minute! Did you forget I was pushed down by Kohei? <laughs> Stop your monkey show. He's not brave enough to do things like that. He will never do things that upset me. He might be a nerd and have zero sense in fashion, but when it comes to things like this, I trust him. Kanade. Seriously, you two? I've gone this far. Why didn't he fall for it? He already knew how mean you were when he saw you with Satoru. You can save it for yourself. I will never let him go. <laughs> Fine! Just you wait and see. Me and Satoru will become a much, much happier couple than you guys. Then she left saying those words. It was later found out that she was pregnant. Well, it is none of our business anyway. Kanade. <laughs> Be more careful next time. You became a handsome guy because of me, you know. There are a lot of mean girls like Mio around. I will keep that in mind. Thanks for believing in me. I you are m my... B boyfriend of course I would trust you yeah I am even though it's fake we're still a couple come on let's go back to the classroom I am hungry wait Kanade I will only say it once listen well it nearly broke my heart when I saw you on top of her eh? I knew immediately that it was a scheme but there was a moment when I thought that what would I do if you'd been taken away by her Kanade if you are in my shoes, what would you do? Maybe I would be too shocked that I would pass out. You idiot! It's not good to pass out! Kanade, I like you. I know we became a fake couple to make Satoru jealous in the first place, but... Now I want us to become a real couple. You're just a nerd, but now look at you, confessing to me like a big man. Maybe because I have a girlfriend like that. I am the best. I have successfully nurtured my boyfriend into one manly man. Hey. Be prepared. Now that you're my real boyfriend, you better become a better man. Of course, I got it. And that is how we became a real couple. Okay, let's go back to the classroom. This time for sure. Eh? The lunch break is almost over. We have to get back before the class begins. Eh? K Kanade? What kind of boring stuff are you talking about? We have finally become a real couple, and it's just the two of us in the nurse's office. H hey, what are you trying to do? This is the nurse's office. It's your fault. Because of you, I have to see the scene with you with Mio. That was a trap! Then I should overwrite it. Huh? I have to show them that you are mine by marking you. What's wrong with my girlfriend? Her speech and behavior are too frivolous. At this moment, I was prepared to become an adult, but... A few seconds later, Sensei of the nurse's office came back from lunch and... We both got a lecture from Sensei. 